When I was little, I watched many TV shows. I loved Sesame Street the most up until around the age 4 or 5. As I got older, I didn't seem to want to watch Sesame Street anymore. In fact, I began to grow a hatred for Sesame Street. Eventually, I began to just start watching other shows at the time. I was more into cartoons then. I remember sitting in front of my TV, wearing pajamas, watching Spider-Man all day. Why did I ever make the mistake of ever changing my mind in the first place? Anyways, I grew tired of old cartoons and moved on to shows like Blue's Clues. One day, when I was alone and my mother was napping, I thought I would go look for a show to watch, since none of the shows I watched were on. I picked up the channel changer for the first time in my life and stared at it for a good 20-30 to 30 seconds. It seemed like rocket science to me. I didn't know what else to do but to just play around with the buttons until something changed. After playing around a little bit, the channel ended up changing, and I saw an old cartoon I used to watch at the time, which was Sesame Street. I didn't like it, but I put the channel changer down and watched it anyways. I was watching one specific channel all day. I even learned what the channel number was so I could watch it whenever. One day, while I was being babysat by my mom's friend, I switched the channels to the TV faster than you can ever imagine. I was even on the right channel, but the show I saw wasn't anything I'd seen before. I guess you couldn't really call it a show, considering it only played during commercial breaks, but I remember what I saw. It was a puppet show. The intro would be a show of a puppet girl being driven by her mom into her grandma's house. The show was actually about the girl visiting her grandma. I remember what the puppet girl looked like though. She had creepy black eyes, no noise, and a line of a mouth which widely stretched across her face. I'm pretty sure she was the only puppet with that look. The others would look like actual people. The intro didn't have a song either. It was just the girl getting out of the car getting right into the house. Then it would end and the show would begin. I never really wanted to watch the show, but I guess it was too interesting to avoid. It was pretty repetitive though. A puppet girl would do activities with her grandma. The grandma would always be pissed off though. The puppet girl was always quiet and would sometimes shake. This made no sense considering she seems perfectly fine in the intro. The show was completely silent. I would watch this show more and more over the years, and the more and more I watched it, the more violent it seemed to get. There were even some episodes where Grandma would abuse the puppet girl just cause she screwed something up. I, uh, I never wanted to ever see this show, but I can't forget about it. I guess they cancelled the show pretty early, cause I haven't heard of it ever since. I shared everything I know. The show is called Nana Land. <laughs>